So for the NPAs or nasopharyngeal airways, these are the ones that you put in if the patient is somewhat awake but not quite awake yet to breathe. Also, this helps when you're bagging a patient because it opens up the airway. It is important that you measure these prior to inserting one. So I'm, I'm not sure what size she's going to take. So you're going to want to take a look at different sizes. The packaging usually will have the size there for you. Okay, so this one's an eight, this one's a seven and a half. And if you don't know, you can also look. Because if it's in the patient and you don't have the packaging anymore, you can look. And there's the size there. That's something you'll need to document. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to measure. Let's try this one first. This is going to the tip of the nose here. And to the tip of the earlobe. And obviously this one's too long. So we're not going to use that. You don't want to use anything that's too long for the patient because instead of creating an airway, you're going to occlude the airway. So I'm going to try the seven and a half. Okay, again, to the tip of the nose. And that's just about right. So this is, this is what I'm going to use. But I'm going to show you this one because this one will be too short. This one's a six and a half. And as you can see, it doesn't even reach the earlobe. So we won't use that. Make sure you put lube on here. Okay. Need to make sure that that's properly lubricated. And you're gonna want to look in the patient's nose, if you know, because if they have a deviated septum, you don't wanna really insert this. So I know that this is okay, so I'm going to choose the right mirror. See how it kind of flares out like this? This you want to be towards the middle of the nose. So I'm going to insert this. So maybe her nares are a little smaller, but this is the right size for her. So I'm going to insert this. Usually goes in a little bit earlier, easier than that. Okay. I'll use a smaller one because that doesn't seem to fit this patient. Okay. We know that that was the proper size. And for real patients, it actually goes in all the way. So you want this all the way in so it's flush against the nares. And that's how you put that in. You can, if you need to, you can put a second one as well. And that helps to open up the airway. Open it up like that.